calamarata pasta is typically served with a seafood sauce. Today we'll be making a delicious saltfish ragu. Let's get cooking. Start by preparing the tomatoes, remove the vine and cut in half. Alright, now remove the skin from the edge of the saltfish steak. Use a knife to slice it off. Then chop into cubes. First cut in strips. Then into small cubes. Finally chop the parsley, discarding any large stems. Time to cook. Saute the garlic in the extra virgin olive oil. When it turns light brown, add the tomatoes. The garlic can be removed later if you prefer, once the flavor is released. Add the capers. I'm using capers in vinegar. If you're using capers in salt, remember to rinse off the salt before using. Pinch of salt. And ground pepper. Now, cook for about 15 minutes. In the meantime, cook the pasta. Add coarse salt to the boiling water. And drop in the pasta. It resembles the shape of calamari rings, as you can see, hence its name calamarata. Cook the pasta for half the cooking time, then drain and add to the sauce so that it absorbs all the flavors as it finishes cooking. Before draining, reserve some of the pasta cooking water and add one ladle full at a time until the pasta is cooked. All that's left to do now is cook the saltfish just a couple of minutes. Same method, a little oil, clove of garlic to be removed later and saute until slightly brown. When the oil has absorbed the garlic flavor, add the diced saltfish. And a little white wine. Let it evaporate. Remove the garlic. Then add the saltfish to the pasta. Pasta will be cooked in a minute, so sprinkle with parsley. And adjust with salt and pepper if needed. And while it finishes cooking, let's see together the ingredients needed for this recipe. Ingredients for four servings. 
3 quarter pound of Kalamarata pasta, 14 ounces of cherry tomatoes, 1 clove of garlic, 1 heaping tablespoon of capers in vinegar, 1 and a third tablespoons extra virgin olive oil, 1 pinch of salt, pepper to taste. For the salt fish, 2 third pound of salt fish, 1 clove of garlic, 2 third tablespoon of extra virgin olive oil, 1 and a third tablespoons of white wine, 1 pinch of salt, pepper to taste, 1 sprigs of parsley. Colorful, tasty and flavorful, the calamarata pasta with saltfish ragu is a must try. Serve al dente with a generous amount of parsley. Cook it yourself and let me know if you like it.